takeaway of yours that yeah. just wants to go. Okay, you know, like so this and try to cover the ball. It's all just. A I let, my players know this. Ball. My players all know this, and this is one thing that's really important. Whenever their hands travel above the level of their body and are above their shoulder plane, and their body starts making that rotate, we our players know ABR always be rotating. We we know it's a constant move through impact. The second, the second you stop rotating, you're done. done. Okay, so. With that being said, the only way that's possible is through connection because if the hands do get above our shoulders level and we are always rotating, well guess what? Those hands have nowhere to go but this way. But if we stay connected, chest looking at hands, guess what? Hands are going to come Common right back down. Connection. Common theme connection. Common theme, absolutely. Keep it together. Keep it one piece. Feel that little 45 degree angle moving. Oh, yes. Yeah, come on. Let's get it. And then keep the chest and like hands. The Watch. Down. This one's not going to wipe right at all. You're going to stripe this thing. No chance. Chest and hands together to the top. Let's go. Oh, it was so good. It was so good, dude. That was fantastic oh, back swing. And it was so on plane. Good job, buddy. I just want the viewer to know this, though. The shot before, he got, he got fast at the top. Just kind of let the hand do the work. So maybe we can even go back and we can play that before swing, play the other swing, and we can see a difference there. And what we can maybe do is see that boom, boom. And when that chest starts moving, club is left behind. Think about baseball, right? Body goes, you know, bat back here, just late, right field dugout. Same thing true in golf. Yeah, we don't like that. We don't like that. Okay, here we go. Next one, he was patient. So when the patience took place, his body took a hold of his hands, kept it going back there, and it made it easier for everything to fire on the way through. Yeah. Perfect, dead straight shot. Awesome, dude. Sung JM does it too. They're very patient to hear, and then they go. You get all your power right here with this move. You don't get your power with this right here. Yeah. Exactly. Oh, come on. Let's, let's actually see a Hideki, Not because Hideki would be wonderful for your golf swing anyways. This is fantastic. Hideki Matsuyama, right. 2021 Master's, Masters Champion. Why are we such big fans of Hideki Matsuyama drills here, guys? Tyler, why? Because when you get it to the top, you gotta be patient here, and then it gets the arms and the, and the body just moving together in one piece. What he just said is the big key. You guys, we're all about the change of direction. People know it as the transition. We say, if I'm gonna go bare bones basics, but, eat, but really, as, as a kind of simplicity being the ultimate sophistication. I mean, here, here it is at its finest right here. Three components of connection in the golf swing. You have the club in front of hands. You have the hands in front of body. And you have where the pressure in the feet is at the given times the club and the hands are in those spots. So when you have the Hideki drill really dialed in, it's because the hands, club, body, and the pressure get into the right places at the right times. If I were to have all those components of connection come together, really how long I hold it up there has no relevance to how good the shot is going to be or the power that I'm gonna be able to create in the golf shot. Let me give my Hideki. Let me, let me, let me, let me okay, okay, okay Tyler, we'll give you one more chance here. More give him the Hideki. There we go, that's a decky. Oh gosh, that's, I don't even want to hit one after that, but I'm going to anyways. Coming out. It's pretty striped right there. Do a cam sisk for us. Oh. I love the takeaway. The takeaway was so good. Exactly like him. Talk about somebody who gets it into a spot. Cam, it's not a bad thing cam to moves it here before anything ever really starts in his swing. And same, you know, Mark Angiano used to do that, a great ball striker we had. Here it is. And it's amazing. Dude, he even he even does exactly what Tyler does of the exact amount of bounces to get yeah. there. It's amazing. That's so good, Tyler. Cam's literally keeps it. He keeps it with his center of his body, frame by frame by frame. But it's it's a good trigger. Everyone has the, their triggers with their swings, and but what is that? Gets you comfortable. That's the problem area. Yeah. That's where people lose it right away. So it's together, and then it just moves, and it's that's something else. Because you just stripe that, by the way. 
<laughs> Give him one more of those, okay? It's unbelievable you do it that well. Okay, what are you guys laughing about? Oh, I want to see this too. Bring it in. Bring it in tight. Money right let's, let's, let's everybody check this out. <laughs> yeah, you gotta get on in here. It helps a lot though. You ready? It does help. Oh my gosh, look at, look at the way he does it. The little boom, boom. <laughs> <There we go. laughs> That's incredible, dude. My miss has always been a little bit off the heel. Yes. And I feel like this is getting it a little bit more towards the center of the face. Yes. But what am I gonna do to munch that right in the center? Okay, <laughs> okay. The heel, the heel miss, is, I'm, I'm tired of it, that's for sure. All right, ready for this? This is just, this is especially for you here, TK. All right, buddy. If I'm hitting the center of the ball right there. Yeah. Guys, if the club gets a little behind the hands, what do I have to do if I bring it down the right path to get it squared up? A little tiny toss. Guess what, watch this. I'm coming through, I'm coming through, I'm coming through. And I give it that little tiny toss right into the heel. That's what gets the club out, wow. even when the hands don't look like they're out. You're sitting there like, oh my gosh, my hands are oh, so I'm in right here. In slot, I'm in the right? slot, and then what the heck is it in the heel for? Right There's no here. reason. Yeah, Boom, look at that, guys. But watch this. Mm. I keep that going through. No reason to flip. And every single time I see the heel hit on my okay. club or in anybody's, I make sure that club is set in front of their hands. Oh, yeah. You know, just, we are so thankful for our YouTube channel. So thankful for the opportunity to you know, share our love for the game, our knowledge for the game, our pl young players with you guys. Um, we appreciate Gabe Ryder so much. Mike, I'm gonna bring you in. Uh, Mike's over here teaching as well next to me. And uh, you know, Gabe has done a fantastic job with our YouTube channel and we appreciate him. But uh, you know, Mike, he's, he's gonna be pursuing some- uh, Some other opportunities, Other right? opportunities. We give him our full blessing on that. We know he's gotta do what he's gotta do. And, um, you know, we're gonna we're gonna keep moving forward though for you guys and we got a big surprise for you. We got big Kev now <laughs> behind the camera. So turn that so camera around. Kevin Albano. Like, yeah. <laughs> Say hi to everybody here. All right, there he is. Kevin's the man, you guys. Kevin is the man. He's a he's an experienced the man videographer, the video, uh, experienced editor. We're really, really excited. He's a, he's a big dude though, so if his angles change and I look extra short in these videos, it's because he's a little bit taller up there. So hey, um, Kev, you're gonna need to bend down quite often, bud. Keep <laughs> keep that camera low. <laughs> but hey, more real quickly though, Gabe's family will always be. He's always a part of our team. We Absolutely. love him. Uh, he's been a huge part of this. You know, all these guys know Gabe. We all love him. We all appreciate him. So, anyways, uh, but we appreciate Kevin. It's a new chapter for us guys. And guess what? Absolutely. It's going to keep getting better. When he gets to go back though and see his 16 videos that he's had, you know, this year, and they all say, "Hey, bud, just keep the club in front of you. Keep the elbow down at the top." And he goes, "Oh." There, you know, that, that's a common denominator. Maybe I should do that.